Welcome back to KSHB 41's live coverage of opening day for the Royals 2024 here at Kauffman Stadium. Yeah, we were uh, down in the Hall of Fame or up in the Hall of Fame, I should say, uh, standing <laughs> next there. to the World Series trophy from yeah. 2015. Man, we were just talking about opening day this year going. This marks 10 years since the start of it all. The magic of the 2014 2015 World Series runs phenomenal. So I checked in with a former first base Royals all star Eric Hosmer, World Series Which champion. You can still find lots of Haas jerseys all across town. Oh, yeah. Yeah, and you know he's doing a new podcast, so okay. I wanted to reach out to him about that too. It's called Digging Deep. He's one of the hosts on that, and, and they talk to former players, yeah. and they're sharing some insights, sharing some old stories. So I wanted to ask him about how that's going, and if he's keeping in touch with some of the folks. They went to Arizona. Yep. Okay. Did I see you guys went to Arizona for an episode to catch some spring training guys? We did. We went to Arizona. We got a bunch of guys out there. Um, Salvi came on. Moose came on. Uh, Bobby Witt Jr. came on, which I will say I am the biggest Bobby Witt fan after finally getting to talk to him. And I had met him a couple times in passing, never really gotten to talk in depth with him. But to be able to talk to him for about an hour, just kind of hear how strong he is mentally, the work he puts in, uh, how close he is with his family and how good of a teammate and person he is. It was really cool to hear him say, too, that his son, Jack, who he thinks will always follow Royals baseball, now he thinks he's going to be following a lot of Bobby Witt, too. That just puts another feather in the cap for the Royals, for his own son, Absolutely. for the future of the fandom there. By the way, Bobby Witt bobblehead for the first, I think, I can't remember how many thousands of fans get in today. The first ones get this new Bobby Witt bobblehead of him and sliding. Yeah. There's a really cool one we showed you earlier in the Hall of Fame, so look for that if you're coming out earlier to the K. Speaking of Bobby, I got a chance to talk to him exclusively, one-on-one -on -one yesterday at the open practice for fans to come to, talk about that new contract, talk about his offseason, talk about the pressure he feels, just 23 years old and now the face of the franchise. More of that coming up.